What's up you guys and welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Vin here and in today's video I'm going to switch things up a little bit by doing a fragrance review. Yeah, that's right guys We're getting into reviewing colognes now. I just recently got into colognes and now I'm obsessed with it watching so many YouTube videos from channels like Jeremy Fragrance, Big Beer Business, Cuba No, Brooklyn Fragrance Lover, just to name a few and the list goes on. There's more that I watch but from watching them, I was able to get into the hobby of wearing cologne on a daily basis. I own many, not many, I own like at least seven bottles of cologne, but they're more of the designer. They're in the designer category of colognes. In today's video, I'm going to be going over none other than the boss, the king of them all, Creed Aventus. Now this comes from the niche house, Creed. And the first time I smell this cologne, it's actually a funny story. I was coming back from vacation with my fiance from Mexico and as soon as we walked out of the airport at JFK, we walked past this guy and we walked, as soon as we walked past him, we got hit by this amazing scent that we never smelled before to the point where we had to go around, <laughs> we had to turn around and ask this guy, what are you wearing? And he said, I'm wearing Creed Adventist. So I said, all right. Later on that, that week, I Googled it and I saw the price tag. I said, holy shit. This cologne costs around 400, over $400 for the smallest bottle. So at that point, I was thrown off a little bit and I said, forget it. I was good with my Aqua de Gel and my Mr. Burberry and colognes and that nature. Until recently, when I started getting more into these YouTube videos, I said, that's it. Let me order a sample. I ordered a sample. I sprayed it on and that was the end of the story. It was a wrap. My fiance went crazy over it. I got so many comments from everyone I walked past. And I said, that's it, I need to buy the full bottle. So here it is, Creed Aventus. And yes, this is the four ounce bottle, it's the biggest bottle. And I'll leave the link where I got it before, uh, after the video, I'll leave the link below. I did get it from fragrance.net because they are a discounter. I don't know if they're considered a great market, but it was a, on a discount. There was no way I was paying full price for this cologne. But let me tell you, even though it's still expensive on fragrance.net, is worth every penny. If you are out there looking for that one fragrance, just that one fragrance that you want to buy and you want to be known by, Creed Aventus is definitely the cologne that you want to be buying. You will get tons of compliments. In my opinion, this cologne is a 10 out of 10. It's perfect. After wearing this cologne, all my other colognes don't even match up anymore. And people just want to know where I'm going to be wearing Creed Aventus again. No one, no one really cares about the other ones anymore. Which is kind of a bad thing because I do enjoy other scents as well. A few others from Creed, uh, Creed's line of uh, fragrances that I love is Green Irish Tweed and Virgin Island Water. I am working on getting a bottle of Green Irish Tweed next. But it is much less expensive. It's half the price of this. So I, I definitely have to pick up a bottle of that. Now... I do not, I'm not an um, a expert on notes in a fragrance, which is the ingredients that they put in this bottle. I have, I'm not an expert on that. I don't know what patchouli, bergamot, I'm not too sure what those individually smell like. But I can tell you right off the bat, let's pop the cap open. Oh my God, this is the best, guys. This is the best. You do get a smell. It's very citrusy and a woody and musky at the same time. It is a beautiful... This smells like none other. None other. I'm telling you right now. And you do get a little hint of pineapple in there as well. Now, let's test out the atomizer on this, which is when you spray it. You guys see that? Oh my God. I had to breathe it in. I had to breathe it in. It's just too much. It's too good to waste. I don't want to spray in the air and waste it, so I had to move into it. But... I'll give you a little bit more close-up of the bottle. As you can see here, we've got the Creed, Creed, and this is all in the glass. It's all raised out of the glass. And you can see there the Aventus, and it is a nice curved shaped bottle, as you can see here. It looks beautiful on the shelf. And there is the top of the bottle, which is just beautiful. Having this in your room just looks like your royalty. It just makes me feel like expensive. <laughs> It makes you feel luxurious is the is the answer. So let me put that to the side. All in all, this is the best fragrance I have ever smelled. I do hope that Creed comes out with other fragrances that could top this so we can just keep on climbing, keep on getting the best that's out there. Because I am telling you, 
if you're looking to buy a cologne, just not for self-enjoyment, but for others to love and to get compliments, Creed Aventus is it because I'm telling you, even though this is the most popular Creed uh, cologne out there, and if you ask someone if they know about Creed, they're probably going to say, oh yeah, I know Creed Aventus. Not like they're going to be saying Green Irish Tweed, Virgin Island Water, and so on and so on. But even though it's very popular, most people haven't smelled this yet. So if you put this on, you're going to be turning heads left and right, guaranteed. So to wrap up this video, as I said before, the link will be down in the description where I got it. If you guys would like me to post more videos on men's fragrances, because I do have a couple more designers and I do have other samples of other, other niche colognes. If you want me to continue on this topic, please leave a comment down below and say keep on going. And I will, because I do have a couple fragrances I left that I can still review. But in my opinion, Creed Aventus is the top of my collection. And if you want to see pictures of, of the collection that I have, check out my Instagram. I do have a picture of all the bottles I have so far. And thank you again for watching. Please hit the thumbs up and hit that damn notification bell as well so you're notified every time I drop a video. And I'll see you all in the next one. Take it easy. Peace.